What's going on gamers? In today's Madden 22 breakdown, we're going to go over the most overpowered glitchy defense to make you more successful. Stay tuned. What's up everybody? If you want to take your Madden 22 game into the next level, the link in the description has my ebooks and every ebook that you get gets a free upgrade for four months. I repeat, free upgrades for four months. Let's get it. Now, before we get further in the video, I want to give a shout out to some key supporters, Keys Incorporation and Daniel Ramirez. Every month, we're going to have up to a $50 gift card giveaway, so stay tuned. Hit that red subscribe button. It's free. And make sure your notifications is on and go ham in the comment section. Now, right now we are in my hide and seek offense but we're going to be more on the defensive side i just want to give you all a sneak peek on how you can take one formation and audible down okay so with this offense the whole point is you will never see dollar and dime type packages because you can audible down to four different formations with the same type of pass concepts but this video is about the cover six I am in the nickel 245 and I'm about to give you a full breakdown on how to use it. Now, the first thing that you always have to watch out for is flats by the tight end and a running back route. That can be an out route by the running back or that could be an in route by the running back. Now, when you are facing plays like trips tight end and gun bunch, you have to worry about the slot cornerback also with your user. Everything goes, you can man up on the field by yourself. Now you see that adjustment. Cover six is a matching principle, okay? So with that adjustment, I was able to worry about the right side of the field by putting a hard flat on the left side or the solo wide receiver side. He was looking for the running back. That is usually the number one read when you are facing most bunch users, okay? So when we take a look at this right here, you can see I am more aggressive. So I blitz both middle linebackers and I want my opponent to make a quick read, okay? So I have both middle linebackers blitzing. I wanna see what is his plan. So the running back comes out and he has long developing routes on the play. So sometimes you have to be very, very aggressive. You have matching concepts behind you to help out. Second and 10, we're gonna play more coverage. I'm manning up the running back and right here I see he blocks the running back. So my aggressive defense approach is working so far. So he throws it where there is coverage at, okay? So third and 10, soft squat and matching principles on the right side. I have the running back manned up. I'm blitzing the other linebacker. I'm expecting for the running back to come out. And once again, he blocks the running back. Now I am making 20 yard adjustments with the cover two and a cover three shell. All I do is blitz all my linebackers and I want to slant my defensive line toward the blitzing cornerback. He has seven people blocking. I have six man blitz set up and we still get two people at the quarterback. If you enjoy these breakdowns, drop a like on the video, hit that red subscribe button, let's get to 10K, and I will keep pumping out this type of in-depth breakdowns. So right here, we are on offense again. Like I said, I can go from my single back bunch nasty, hide and seek offensive scheme, and I can audible down to a smaller package, and I can hit the seams. What most people gonna play is cover two. Now. You can see with this offense, I have two open routes. I have RB and I have X for a deep bomb. Get this offense right here if you want to style on your opponent. 